I'm Dr. Rentia, Director of the Comprehensive Colorectal Center at Children's Mercy. We are dedicated to helping children born with complex colorectal conditions and severe functional constipation. Bowel management is a clinical experience in which we work on getting the bowels and colon empty and the child clean for poop. There are many treatment options available. Please contact us at the Comprehensive Colorectal Center to discuss which option is right for your child. How to perform post-surgical anal dilations. Anal dilation is an aftercare home procedure performed for children who have had surgery to correct imperforate anus. Many times after surgery, the body wants to close the surgical wound. Anal dilations is done to keep the newly created anus open and to the correct size. A plastic dilator is put into the child's anus twice a day. Supplies include water-soluble lubricant and a set of Hagar dilators in different sizes. Wash your hands with soap and water. Gather your supplies close to where your child will be during anal dilation. If you can, have two people. One person will insert the dilator and one will hold the child in position. Select the dilator and put a good amount of water-soluble lubricant on the end of the dilator. Hold the dilator like a pencil in your hand to write with and insert it gently into the anus. Roll it back and forth while you insert the dilator only inserting the dilator about two inches. Do not force the dilator if it does not go smoothly. Continue to gently spin the dilator between your fingers for about 30 seconds. Gently remove the dilator, change your child's diaper, and wash the dilator with warm soap and water. Note, before using a new size dilator, first insert the dilator size you already have been using. This helps the new dilator size go in easier because it lubricates the rectum. Points to remember. Dilations may be harder to do the closer you get to the goal size of the dilator. It is important to keep increasing the size of the dilator each week until the desired size is achieved so that scar tissue does not form. Make sure you have a firm hold of your child when performing dilations. Your child should have no straddling positions, frog-leg positions for the first three months after surgery. When to call with questions. When the dilator does not go in or when your child experiences more discomfort than usual. For more information or to make an appointment, visit our website at childrensmercy.org forward slash colorectal.